Tell us about a time you had to lecture a loved one or friend on women's rights. I don't know what is lecture, or I forgot what is lecture. Um, so a lecturer is like a, a teacher. So if you lecture oh, someone, okay. you can explain. I can't remember, but I'm sure I did this sometime. So I had to lecture a student on women's rights once. And um, there was this one guy that stood up and he said, you see, I don't think that they should have the same rights as us because as soon as women stepped into the labor market, our wages decreased. <laughs> and I was like, excuse me? <laughs> he said, yes, because women are in the labor market now, they're not paying as much for men. Guys, I had to stop the class for about 14 minutes to lecture him on women's rights. When you witness a situation like this, you have to step up. That's why we read this. Yeah, a lot of the time it can be very difficult though because if you're in a work environment um, and you try and stand up for yourself, maybe it's your boss that's being like that and he's saying, oh, no, but women shouldn't be in the workplace. If you stand up to him, a lot of the time if he's superior to you in the workforce, he's going to just fire you or put you in a lower pedestal just because you're like going against him. So a lot of the time women will keep quiet just to like keep themselves safe. Well, the good thing about it is now we are talking about it because when I think about my mother, that would be impossible. You know, when I think about my grandmother, that was forbidden.